The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. Well, there's a reason why this guy's the champ, and I think he's about to show us what that reason is. This is what it's all about. Two competitors going head to head to decide which one is truly the best. Introducing the challenger from Scotland, weighing in at 177 pounds, So much anticipation, and it all comes down to this. This is it, the moment we've been waiting for. The time for talking is behind us. Now these two superstars will test one another's abilities and will like never before. This is about being the best. These guys are gonna need to show some guts and heart if they hope to leave here with the gold. Both these superstars are primed and ready to roll. But here's the thing, you have to perform if you wanna bask in that WWE glory. 
Guys, let's quickly discuss the champion. The champ has been here before. What do you expect from him in his title defense? That's a proud champion, Michael, for sure. But there's also a hungry challenger in that ring, and I have no idea which way this one's going to go. Well, in this world, you got a chance to make a national impact every time you step in the ring. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. Absorb so much of that. And he snaps off by Rick and Rana. He drops the elbow. We've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. The challenger is starting to slow down a bit here. But not for a second do I expect him to back down. That. Here's a cover. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. When this guy's on, look out. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. What a counter. Timber, and he falls hard. Uh-oh, look at this. Oh, Trying to put him away. That's it. He's done. There it is. The finisher. This could all... We got a cover. Up. He got the shoulder up. Wow, what a display of heart and determination. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. He's endured heavy blows here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match, King. Oh, my gosh, this is awful. I'm going to tell you something. Whenever you get hit like that, for the next 15 minutes, everybody you see has an exact win. I believe that is the first time tonight we've seen that move. We got a cover. And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. He's showing the heart of a warrior here tonight. to the side of that one. The champ starting to sweat. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. Hmm. That's a good point, Michael. And I'm also starting to wonder if he's starting to lose confidence in his finisher after already using it with limited success twice. Yeah, and he's already used his finisher twice so far. You get the feeling that he's really going to... Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Man, he's got to be running on empty at this point. I'm not sure. He seems to have something left. After the amount of punishment he suffered, it's simply amazing that he's still in this one. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's looking to put his opponent... He's inflicting some serious pain here. The champ to the top turnbuckle. What's he got in mind? He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Off the top rope. Hey, look at him sneak one in. One, two.
Here are your winners and new Noah Durr. We have a new champion. Unbelievable. But let's not forget, we have a new champion. The arena is still buzzing over that great match.